Hello, friends. Today, we'll learn about the latitudes and longitudes of the Earth. Have you ever wondered how the location or position of any place is determined? Let me explain this. Whoa, it looks so yum. Our Earth looks like an orange. It is spherical from the sides and flat at the top and bottom. The latitudes and longitudes are invisible lines that help us identify a place using geometrical coordinates. An easy way to remember the orientation is that latitudes are lateral mm, and longitudes are long. Let's learn about them one by one. At first, latitudes. Latitude lines circle the globe in east-west direction. It measures how far north or south a specific point lies from the equator. They're also known as parallels. The equator at zero degrees separates the Earth into northern and southern hemisphere. Locations to its north lies in between zero degrees north to 90 degrees north, while to its south the positions are between zero degrees south and 90 degrees south. The distance between each degree of latitude is approximately 69 miles. And now, the longitudes. Longitudinal lines run from the North Pole to the South Pole. It measures how far east or west a point lies from the prime meridian. These are also known as prime meridians. Longitudes can value from 0 degrees to 180 degrees east. The distance between longitudes at the equator is the same as latitude, roughly 69 miles. At 45 degrees south or north, the distance between is about 49 miles. The distance between longitudes reaches to zero at the poles as the lines of meridian converge at that point. Now we'll see some of the notable latitudes and longitudes. The most important of these are the equator and the prime meridian. The equator is a line passing through the center of the Earth and is considered as the reference point for latitudes, whereas the prime meridian is a line passing through Greenwich, England and is considered as the reference point for longitudes. Hmm, it is also the source to calculate time and international dateline. Each degree refers to four minutes. There are 24 time zones in the world. If an event happens at 11 a.m. in Greenwich, England, it would be reported at 4.30 p.m. in Calcutta, India. The other important latitude is the Tropic of Cancer in the north and the Tropic of Capricorn in the south. Apart from these, the Arctic and Antarctic Circle at 66.5 degrees north and south, respectively, are equally necessary. These latitudes divide the Earth into the Tropic Zone. It's the hottest zone with countries like Colombia, Brazil, Kenya. Temperate Zone, the moderate zone with countries like India, Japan, United States of America. And the Polar Zone, the coldest zone with countries like Norway, Iceland, and Finland. Penguins live in the polar zone's southern hemisphere. That's it for today, kids. Stay tuned for next video. Bye-bye.